hello guys <coughs> sorry welcome back again to my channel this is shades of madi so today i'll be designing the second uh, party flyer so let's start my canvas size is um, 1080 by 1350 you click on create before i continue let me show you my instagram my sorry my youtube page rather you can see i already have 1540 subscribers and they've they've enjoyed over 80 80 free psd files you can see see the files here free psd file you can click on the follow the subscribe button and you know turn on your post notification to get notified whenever i post a new video you can see different videos with free psds just subscribe and you know download the file it's it's free for you to use so let's go back to my tutorial let me do a breakdown for you here you can see this this is just a normal background this is a gradient background it's a it's gradient background so let me copy this copy and paste you know just to make the video shorter let me show you what I did here for the green valley. This is a normal gradient, you can see. This is a normal gradient. If I turn this off, you can see this is a normal gradient. So you follow this gradient, you can see at angle at um, zero. Sorry, control Z. You can see at zero, it's on a um, red black. Then at 64 it's on white you can see the difference the different um, layers here you can see if i keep dragging this keep reducing you can see you can see so all you need to do is make, make it balanced make it look look um, balanced and okay let me press press cancel on this this is actually like like a, a background already it's a background so i now added the gradient to it to make it more to, to make it look more okay then what i did next again was to bring in this particular background over here this background oh sorry let me just see background here you can see you can see something like this it's just something like this something like this so now my image will come here Chosen. 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 I use this image because this and this is an AI image so I I worked on the image already to make it look more 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 bright you can see I use them um, color balance and also I use contrast and uh, and brightness you can see at 25 the for the brightness and then the contrast is at zero for this image i'm just showing you how simple it is to gather all this it's very very simple and straightforward so this let me bring this lower text down here this lower text here you can see control v control t t Oh, sorry, V control T, V control T, yeah, something like this. You know, bring it down like this, so you can decide to even work on your on on your image. You can decide to work on it. You know, but let me show you something that you can also do. Click in the here. You can see, set your foreground color to black by clicking this. Then yeah, click on gradient two can do something like this they can reduce the opacity also you can see something like this you can see so you can try to play around it you know this is just a design that i created just for you to you know have fun and do and do your and do you yeah and do you rather so if i click something like this sorry Just i click something like this you know Okay, something like this you can see it's, it's very simple and straightforward then this 
is an overlay like in my previous video you can see how i got this in my previous video you can see i'll bring this behind my my image behind the image Control v to paste it just had that brightness you can see that brightness to it now if you want to create something like this you can all you would do is click new layer on keyboard press b increase your brush size your brush size rather brush size change your foreground color to anything you want to change it to something like this you can have something like this you know then you can tap change the blend mode to linear dodge and you can see simple so if i switch this off you can see if i switch this off you can see you already have you already have um have this you can use this to replace it you, know. you can even duplicate it to still add add that brightness to it you can see how you can have fun with, it, with the design it's very simple and straightforward you can have fun with it so this is just a sample of how i got this particular piece then as usual you know my 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 regular text that i use Montserrat for my designs you can see this is Montserrat semi board let me show you the tra 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 tracking value 10 1820 yes 120 then for this this also uh, this is a very simple text that I, that I got sexy diva I used the font typo longest demo bold then I added outer glow to it. See the settings for the outer glow. Blend mode screen opacity 71. Then spread 0, size 21, range 46. Then color 6898A4. Click your OK. Then you can decide to add some other things that, that I want to add to it. So this is a very simple and straightforward design. Like, like, like I always say, you can do your designs any way you want. Make it easy, make it for make it you. So please don't forget to subscribe and watch my my other videos. Thank you.